Hey everyone, it's Dr. 10 Meteorologist Ross Caruso. I have another exciting experiment for us today. It's very easy and you only need a couple things. Most importantly, what you're going to need is a hair dryer. Our experiment today is going to talk about thunderstorms, more importantly, updrafts, which allow the storms to grow even stronger and which produces heavier rain and even hail. And talking about rain and hail, we also have to introduce that in this experiment. So we're going to use ping pong balls. Try to get at least two of them. And then last but not least, we'll need a golf ball. Notice that these two are about similar in size, but very different in weight. And that'll be something we'll explain here in just a second. But with every thunderstorm, there's something called an updraft. The updraft is a current of rising air within the storm. You can think of it as the heart of the storm. And what this does is it allows the storm to continue to grow. And once it's in its mature stage, it has a very strong updraft and in some cases produces rain and then heavy rain. And then the storm weakens or it can, can produce some hail. And that's in the dissipating stage where then it starts to diminish and further weaken because the downdraft is overrunning the updraft. So this is our updraft, and what we're going to do is we're going to turn this on high to get a current of air. So this will get a little loud here for a second. Now that we have our updraft, we're going to introduce a particle. Watch what happens. Pretty cool, right? So what we're doing right here is we're suspending a particle in the air. You can think of it as a cloud where we get rising air, moisture, particles. It condenses, and we have suspended particles. But now let's say we have more particles in the cloud because that's typically the case. We'll introduce another particle. Watch, sometimes these ping pong balls can switch spots. And that's because we're creating a current of low pressure. You see that, it just switched right there. High pressure on the outside. And what's happening is it's causing these balls to circulate. But there comes a point where you just saw the one got knocked off. And the reason for that, oh, almost grabbed that. The reason for that is because they collided and then they fell. And much like whenever we're talking about a lot of heavy rain or hail, what happens is it becomes too heavy for the updraft and then it falls from the sky. Now, as I mentioned, we do have a golf ball too. So let's see if we can get this to spin in the air as easy. Nothing. Maybe if we had a leaf blower, we can get it to stay a little bit above, but chances are it would still fall. And again, that's because this particle is way too heavy. And this is just a great explanation to show you what happens when we have an updraft in a storm. And when we see very strong updrafts, that typically is linked to a stronger thunderstorm. And that's where you see heavy rain and hail. And again, a very cool, easy experiment for you guys. Let me know what you think. We'll make sure to do another cool experiment for you here shortly. Take care.